Greetings, everybody. Listen, uh, I was just thinking, this is something that I bought. Now, I'm not an expert by any means, but I have used it to uh, find out where uh, people have kept their routers. Uh, there was a lady that was working in um, Arkansas, and she had a router right under her desk, and she was complaining that she had started losing her hair and stuff. And uh, I tested it with this, uh, they call it an RF meter, and it went off the charts. So I told him about it, showed him, next time I went, I brought the meter and um, showed him what the um, readings were. The readings, it has a green, yellow, and then a red. And, um, I mean, it's more than just three buttons. I mean, lights. It's got like, I don't know, like three green, three yellow, three red. And when, when all three of the red are you know, on, you know, it's, it's hot. It's really hot. But the thing is, uh, they moved the router. And then the next time I showed up, they told me, oh, well, we moved the router. So I got the, the, the RF meter, the radio frequency meter. And I located the router without them telling me. I told them, don't tell me where the router is. I'm going to find it. And I did. It took me, you know, about a minute. You know, it was a big office. I haven't been back to talk to her if her hair got better, but uh, I've been using this thing uh, around the house. You can check your cell phones. You can check your Wi-Fi. Uh, from what I understand, Comcast, which is like 50% of the internet in the United States, automatically turns on the Wi-Fi on a router, even if you're using um, it hardwired. A lot of your new cars have got Bluetooth. That's RF. And um, so also, if you were, uh, you know, checking the power signals of the G12345, it detects that too. It detects any frequency from 200 megahertz to 8 gigahertz. So your, uh, the, uh, G Wiz 123455 is in that range, and you can find out if uh, you're cooking or not. Matter of fact, I uh, when the microwave came on, which I don't use it, but other people in the household do, um, I checked it, and the meter went off the chart. So, might be useful to know when... Uh, you're being cooked and maybe you can take appropriate action I'm not so sure what that is uh, aluminum foil whatever matter of fact I suggest if you have uh, if you bought some seeds and stuff you might want to put them in aluminum foil or metal ammo cans or something like that so uh, what's interesting though is during World War two that uh, G whiz one two three four five is the same frequency as radar. Matter of fact, the original uh, Mana microwave ovens were called radar ranges for that purpose. But a lot of the technicians and people that worked with radar during World War II came down with um, what they called radar sickness, and they didn't understand why. And one of the guys, uh, I think it was an engineer, uh, noticed that you could use microwave to cook things because he had a candy bar in his pocket. And when he was working around the radar, the uh, chocolate melted. And that's how they, you know, figured it out. So, I don't know. I, I don't know the solution to all this stuff. All I know is Jesus said to be is wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Uh, this meter, it's EMF fields, EM fields, 
the Acousticom 2. It's made in England, England, not China, to the best of my knowledge. And uh, it seems pretty sturdy. This is the second one I've owned. First one got stolen by the thief in Arkansas. But um, it uh, seems to be well made. It works. I've tested on stuff. And, uh, you know, it can... It takes about 30 seconds to figure out how to use it. So uh, it's on... You can buy it from Amazon. And um, it's $180. I know money's tight for most everybody, but uh, it might be worth investing so that you know what's going on. Because I have a feeling they're going to turn on the um, gee whiz, one, two, three, four, five, and then blame it on the the beer, the Corona beer. Yeah. Yeah, everybody's getting sick from the second wave. And let me tell you something. They've been putting up new polls all over the place. Uh, I saw them doing it in Harrison, Arkansas. I saw them doing it when I was traveling. And I saw them doing it down here in South Florida. Replacing new, uh, new wood poles, fairly new wood poles, with concrete poles. Because this... Um, G whiz, uh, one, two, three, four, five, requires very, very heavy power lines. It's not for communication. It's, it's for, I mean, you're talking thick, heavy power lines. So, you know, it's, it's for something other than just communications. If they just wanted to do communication stuff, they would be using fiber optics. I mean, fiber optics are fast, they're thin, they hardly weigh anything, and one, pe one fiber can uh, hold a thousand uh, simultaneous two-way conversations. So you get a bundle of those and, you know, but it's not about that. It's, you know, Jesus called them the children of the devil. And uh, he wasn't calling them names. It wasn't a figure of speech. He says, I'm telling you the truth. So, 180 bucks, a radio frequency meter. Matter of fact, go to a university engineering um, radio frequency engineering um, department and look up all the frequencies. And, you know, visible light, infrared, ultraviolet radio frequencies and then look up the uh, microwave frequency it's in the um, gigahertz range of one two three four and then number five yeah that's exactly what it is I looked it up I'm one of those people that uh, doesn't believe anything hardly I gotta check everything out sadly the crazier the thing that you check out the more often it turns out to be true of course there's a lot of disinformation out there so that you know they they want to what they call poisoning the well and um, they they put out something that's false so that when you believe it you know you you look stupid and then the rest of the stuff you tell them they don't believe you, but whatever. God's children are going to know. And the goats, well, they can um, they can get cooked. You ever heard the expression, "Their your goose is cooked"? Well, the ghost, the goat is cooked. All right. Well, Chaplain Bob here, Light of the World Ministries, and I don't know for how long. So, all right. Take care, people. Just remember, stay close to Christ. All glory and honor to him. Amen.